So on our hexose here, our anomeric carbon is this one because it has the two oxygens bound where everywhere else they just have one oxygen bound to it. Okay. So the anomeric carbon has two oxygens usually? Mm -hmm. Okay. That's kind of the easiest way to pull it out. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then to find out if it's a uh, B or an L from a Lewis structure. Is that a Lewis structure? No. Um, What's the stick one called? Two different down. Triangle plank. D is when this is up. Okay. L would be if it's down. Okay. And then alpha is where the OH is down. Beta is where it's up. Oh, okay. Well, really, technically, if this is up, alpha is when it's opposite. Beta is when it's cis to this guy. So if we had an L sugar and the CH2OH was down, then beta would be the OH down. But since we only really deal with D sugars, you just have to recognize, okay, is the OH down or is it up? Okay. So up is alpha, down is beta. Up is beta. Up is beta, down is alpha. Okay. Yeah. For other people, you got to remember it because the OH, or beta is like before the party, your balloons are up. After the party, they've lost the OH, so they're down. So alpha. Yeah, yeah. After.